And now, First One Five Weather with forecaster Stephen Sarabia. It is 928 and check out this view of our Sky 5 cam at the island showing an awesome morning. If you are over in the coast area, we do see some partly sunny skies, but very nice this morning and temperature wise. It's not even going to be that hot over there as well. It, we can see that the Port Isabel South Padre Island area is about 83 degrees this morning. As we move a little bit uh, westward, temperatures do increase 84 in Raymondville, 84 also in Rio Grande City. Here's the future track for those temperatures by 2 p.m. Most of the valley will be in the low 90s, except for the lower valley still hanging around the 80s. 87 for Brownsville, 83 for the island, but 91 for Wesco, McAllen and Edinburgh and also Rio Grande City. Here's a look at this evening, 7 p.m. Rio Grande City still staying in the 90s by then. Everywhere else dropping into the 80s. And a quick look at tomorrow, Labor Day. Starting out in the upper 70s, low 80s across the board for the valley and for the afternoon 3 p.m. Going to be much cooler tomorrow than it is going to be today. 85 for Raymondville, 89 for Edinburgh, 87 for McAllen. So speaking of Labor Day, here's a look at that Labor Day forecast. So we are tracking some rain, about a 50% chance for some thunderstorms. And the best time to see some of those thunderstorms is about noon and the early afternoon. So plan on that if you're doing anything outdoors. The high should be 92, so the low 90s. But again, 50% chance of rain. Only a 20% for today. Nothing really worth canceling any outdoor plans for. But we have a 60% chance of rain on Tuesday. And here's a look at the current wind speeds across the valley. Nice and calm. You know, don't really have to worry about any of those breezy winds. And if you plan on going towards the coast, I know that our Sky 5 cam made it look really awesome this morning. Here's a look at what they can expect today. They're going to stay in the mid 80s at 84. Wind speeds come from the east at 9 miles an hour, partly sunny. And here's a quick look at tomorrow if you plan on going for Labor Day. 85 is the expected high for tomorrow there. We only got one tide today. It's a low tide at 8.04 p.m. Moderate shop on the bay. And a quick look at the seven-day forecast shows a lot of rain for the first half of the week up until Wednesday. We are tracking an early front, which is going to drop temperatures into the upper 80s, starting to feel a little bit like fall now. But enjoy it while you have it, because by Saturday, back into the low 90s for the valley, mostly sunny if you're planning ahead for next weekend. And that's your updated First Warn 5 forecast.